Hey everybody. Well, life happens and if it's not one thing, it's another. Um, just as a quick reminder of our family dynamics, we have uh, Brayden and Rayla, our younger kids, and then we have an older daughter who's almost 20 and you know she is working on being independent and you know she has a job and all these different things she stayed home from the beach this weekend because she had to work and uh yesterday afternoon we get a call from her in tears that she has been in a bad car accident she's okay um it was against a bigger like box type van and almost head on, it spun her out and into a ditch. Airbags deployed. She even like at one point said like as soon after, like she was having a hard time hearing out of one ear and was definitely shook up. Amazingly, there was a deputy who just happened to be there who was able to kind of wrangle everyone around and help get the situation, um, you know, kind of calm down and everything and helped her with the whole process. Um, and she was seen by paramedics at the scene. They said she was okay. And then after everything was kind of taken care of, I think she called a friend or a friend's mom um, and they managed to get her to the ER to be checked out. And she was fine, no concussion, nothing like that. And she went home. She just wanted to be at home, which that's fair. Um, very, very shaken up. And I've been in an accident before and I know just the nervousness that goes into even trying to get into a car again. Um, so I don't, I don't envy her that. Um, it was our car that um, it happened in and it is totaled. It's, I guarantee the insurance company is going to come back and be like, <laughs> nope. Um, so that's another thing that we're going to have to be dealing with. Yay. Um, you know, we don't know the whole process or when we don't have like all of the details of exactly what happened, we'll, you know, be getting copies of, I doubt there's an actual police report, but, um, about like the incident and everything. Um, so we can get all of that over to insurance so we can take care of it. But, um, you know, if you guys can send some healing and some positive thoughts her way it would be awesome. Um, I know one, she's just probably super embarrassed as well as just shaken up from everything. It's still pretty early when I'm recording this, so I, you know, she's still in bed. Um, but we'll be checking in with her later today, seeing how she's doing, kind of getting the whole process started with insurance and everything. Um, I don't think it happened yesterday since she headed to the ER and that's okay. Um, but yeah, man. <laughs> Like I said, if it's not one thing, it's another. So dealing with life, we're going to make do and um, we'll give you guys some updates as we get them. As far as everything else, doing okay. We're still just enjoying the weekend, but I'm going to kind of leave it at that um, as there's, you know, more important things to focus on as well. So, okay. Appreciate you guys and we'll see you tomorrow. Be kind. Make good choices.